Looking, at, I haven't watched your videos, and I've been meaning to, but looking at, like, your thumbnails, you seem really expressive. Uh, and so I think that's great. And so I'm thinking, like, don't be afraid to really kind of have your face in the thumbnail somewhere with that expression. Like, your charcoal mask gone wrong, That the, the, the face you're pulling there is... It's great. It's intriguing. I want to watch it. Uh, frankly, and this might sound weird, but I want to watch because your face. Because I'm like, what made her make that face? Like, you know. Uh, and also, if your face is that expressive, I imagine like in other ways you're very expressive, and that's good because we've probably all seen YouTubers who just sit there and talk monotonously without expressing greatly and are hard to hear and those sorts of things. And you know, I, I like the people who. I mean, I don't like crazy bigger than life. Like, you know, everything is an air horn, but. Um, I think that uh, people who are expressive, who you can see what they're what they're feeling and thinking, and people who are really expressive and stuff, and you can and you can see the reactions, and it's not fake and and that sort of thing. Uh, I think people really identify with. I have a little bit of acting experience, and so um, the little bit of training that I have in that regard, I think uh, I look for I don't know maybe unusual things or things that most people aren't conscious of when um, you know when when I'm a, a consumer of entertainment media. And so, like, I like certain things. Um, try to think of one example uh, of, like, small expressive things you can do with your face. Uh, is the um, the Star Trek movie. It's one of the bar scenes. It's right after, it, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's Captain Kirk and, um, and uh, Pike in the bar. And, and they're having this conversation. And at one point, um, Pike, his sort of new father figure, because his father's passed away, um, basically says, it's going to be all right, son. And there's this super subtle change in uh, uh, Chris Pine's face uh, that is is just so subtle. And it says, like they say, a picture's worth a thousand words. It was just this, this like, there are so many different emotions in such a subtle change in just the way that he was staring. That was kind of the moment that as an actor, I became to appreciate him because he, he was doing the super small stuff and really living in the moment very well. Um, and so that, like, the small expressions, the big expressions, doing it for, appropriately for, for what's going on is, I think... Um, I don't know if it's a skill you develop or a talent you're born with or something, but judging by your thumbnails, you seem very expressive. So I say leverage that. I'd say don't be afraid to put yourself uh, a little bit more prominently in uh, in the thumbnails. And um, yeah, that's that's my thought there is maybe give that some thought. Uh, I know that it's really quite common for people to do like a cutout of themselves with like a white outline uh, to put their face in the uh, thumbnail somewhere. And there have been different like case studies and people have looked at it um, to see that often like thumbnails that have a face, people are more inclined to click on, which is interesting. I don't understand necessarily the psychology behind it. Maybe it's like a human connection thing. I don't know. Um, but maybe experimenting with that a little bit might not be a bad idea.